Hello and welcome to the Forex Workshop and you are now on the Trader's Guide page. I am going to show you how to install the custom indicators and the custom templates. First and foremost, we are going to open MetaTrader 4, which I have open right now. Then the next step is to click on this golden folder, folder over here. Make sure you, you maximize the page, this video, this video screen so you can see where I'm clicking at. So you click on this golden folder right here. Then you click on indicators. Then uh, you click on file, open, find the folder that you downloaded with the indicators. Then open the file. Then click on file, save as. Then save the files in the indicators folder. Save. Close. And close that. And go to templates over here. and go down to load template then go over here on this folder and right click on templates open a new window and when you have this window open drag the templates the custom templates into this window into this folder and close it and then close MetaTrader 4 and reopen it up again when you have reopened MetaTrader 4 you're gonna open the chart now I'm gonna close a couple of these charts I'm gonna show you how to reopen them alright so you go to file new chart Go down to Forex and choose ADUSD. Then click on File, New Chart, and choose Euro JPY. File, New Chart, and you can open the gold chart if you want. Now, to easily organize all these folders all you all you have to do is click right here this this four box icon right here boom now to install the indicators you would click on templates and you click on lows boom done and to go back click on these four boxes and do the same for the other the other two charts that we opened click on those click on the chart go here and then click on those all the indicators are installed you have the session boxes right here this is the Asian session the euro session and the US session you have the stochastic down here and you have the custom templates right here and you have the error indicator right here and you're done I'll see you in our next live training session where I will show you how to use these indicators and how to use the time frames and what exactly each of time frames represent and a lot more. I'll see you at our next live session. Thank you.